I just can't resist the cliche. Fashion week just ended with a bang at Albert Elbaz's show for Lanvin. If you could have felt the love in this place, you'd be smiling for the whole season. They've gotten a designer uh, to come to what was a dead brand and totally changed it. And he just makes really beautiful clothes that work on women. And as you can see from the front row, you have people like Kristen Scott Thomas and Chloe Sevigny. It attracts the cool and the older glamorous woman. I need a story for the music, I need a story for the place here, I need a story for the fabrics. In order for me to get inspired, I need to, to tell a story to myself and then I can tell it and reflect it. You get the feeling that they're the clothes that you dreamt of when you were a little girl. Just gorgeous sort of proper dresses. Albert, did you feel the love out there? Yes. What are you doing to people? I think that when you are honest, and I think when you love, you're being loved, and when you don't, you're not. Everything in life for me is very round. You know, this whole collection was very round. I don't believe in linear. We have to let women decide. We have to bring back simplicity. We have to bring back easiness. My initial reaction to it, though, it's chic, it's sophisticated, but there's a simplicity to it that makes it accessible. It was easy jewel tones. He did the goddess silhouette that he's so well known for. The one shoulder, the draping, the pleating, and the movement of the clothes. The clothes look gorgeous. Coming down the runway, I'm on a fashion high. I think everybody was. What looks very simple actually isn't. Right. That there's an awful lot of construction in there. What he does is so brilliantly. It's like what appears to be a pleat, it's just actually a fold and there's no seam. I mean, it's incredible how he sometimes creates volume and shape. There definitely was a lot of volume there. There was volume, but it was under control. It wasn't something that is going to be difficult for people to, to pull off in, in real life. What looked like a lot of party dresses there. One was more beautiful than the other. I mean, the. The ones with feathers at the bottom and the neckline and then the ruffles, I mean those, those are incredible dresses and every girl's going to want to wear those. Just the atmosphere in this house is just so great. He's a very good guy and I think that he chooses the people he works with very carefully. They share some common kind of soul thing. Sometimes, you know, when I'm kind of on, on a hard day, I wake up the next day and I'm saying, you know, I'm quite happy doing what I do because how many people have the ability to have a dream and to have a team of people around that realize their dream. And that's fabulous.